somebody. <clears throat> okay, so now I'm going to show you guys how to use the Buck Junkie or the saliva and forehead glandular scent. This is our signature series, man. This, this, is the, this is the one that I'm so jacked about. Primarily, we built it so that you could use it on a existing rub tree. So this is a tree that I've seen these deer rub before. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to open it up and show you exactly how I would apply it um, if it were hunting season and we were just getting started. So first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take a knife or a saw or something like that. And I want to just, I want to get to some fresh bark. Now you don't have to go crazy and like do this a whole, whole bunch. What I'm trying to do is get a few cuts in the tree, though, that'll hold some of the scent. Because they have found, or they believe, that these deer pick these trees on purpose. Pick like cedar trees and, and uh, pine trees because they believe that the actual rubbing their forehead on there will actually, that scent will stay longer. So once we get this opened up, we're just going to throw either, you could do it one of two ways. This is an oil. And this one is a paste, and I'll show you how to do both. I'm gonna just take a little bit, put the lid back on this one for right now, and I'm gonna drop this on here. I just want a few drops. And then, that's it. So I just put a couple drops on there, and then I can take my knife, and I wanna kinda of smear it in. Work it into the tree a little bit there. Now, typically, I probably wouldn't use both. I'd use one or the other. But if I want to give a little extra scent, I'll find something that I can stick this on. Because he may have rubbed his forehead on there. And I just slide it over a limb like that where I don't ever even touch that limb. And then I'm going to smear that in too. There's a little bit on the end of my knife. That paste works really good, and the paste is actually going to stay longer than even the oil will. But that oil is going to be powerful. That's why we did it that way. So, and primarily when we're going to start doing this is when your deer start to make rubs. So they got to be out of velvet. I would tell you that probably September and then throughout the rest of the season. So September throughout the season, that's when you want to use your buck junkie. Um, it, it's a glandular scent. It is the forehead and the salivary glands. So you can actually use this as well over a scrape as well. But primarily what we were looking for this for was to be able to put it on a rub, on an actual rub or a rub that you put in yourself. So anyhow, keep that in mind, man. If you're looking for one that's gonna work, salivary and forehead gland, the buck junkie.